Hello everyone, you sexy people. Welcome back to Seasons of Silver. Boy, this scenario is long, isn't it? Like we are in episode 9 now and we're still alive. I'm surprised at that. My first attempt at this um, scenario is looking good so far. Um, blind attempt, that is, as well. I mean, I gotta tap my shoulder from time to time. Do I? Well, I can't. I can't. I can do this from time to time, really. Even though I was so bad at the fuel stuff. Uh, yeah, you can totally... Um, call me out on that. Now, we are still one minute away from the final delivery. I have some resources left over and I would like to do the upgrading. I would like to upgrade my trading post now. That gives me um, 75 tons more storage and I think this can come in very handily for any kind of buffer that we're building up. I have no idea how many more um, deliveries we're going to have here, right? Penultimate delivery, it already hints at something there. We'll just see about that. We got lots of the tears in. The rum is going up. The fish stew is not looking so great. The hot sauce is also not looking so great. But let's just check this one out. We finished that the last episode. And the hot sauce is, yeah, actually not really going up there. Despite us having now a lot of hot sauce breweries. I don't completely understand this right now. Right, we got like five factories for that and here it says though that we are only having three so something is wrong here i mean i have no idea how much we really produce with that let's just get us another one out there that is producing the, the hot sauce now spices is going down officially um is that counting in already my spice farm that is working at 350 percent you can check this one out here too we have a surplus of one there at the moment he has arrived, so we got now 4.5 minutes. Actually, we got 5 minutes. And How do you expect me to maintain quality with that's fine. And we are having 115 silver coins at the moment. The silver amalgam is out now. That's, of course, because they don't work during the, the monsoon. And by the way, I could have also done something here. Pause them, right? Getting some workforce in. Also saving a bit of coin there as well with that. It's just a micromanagement thing here and it's not really the end of the world if I don't do it. Um, silver ammo again, yes. That's the problem. We should have had enough to work through Monsoon as well. If I'm being honest here. So we don't have that. And they consume what again? I always forget it about the silver ammo again. It's so many productions there. It's the silver ore and the cyanide. So at least cyanide should be building up though over Monsoon. Yep, we're at 60 tons almost. So that is working for now. Very good. We do, however, will need another goat farm. Because we have this ammonia plant there now too. And we definitely should do that. I can move. Now, let's get rid of this lumberjack hut. And instead have another goat farm here. There you go. This one will work. That's the six fields. Right, we could have a silo then as well. And then we have the ammonia plants. Let's build that. Build this one. And let's build one of them here too. Right, for the additional consumption there. That's fantastic. Because we do need more of that. Alright. And I still want to check what's going on here really. Ah, there it is. Now it's starting to climb there. So we're at two. And if I open up now the hot sauce for my Honoleros, where will we sit? Of course, lots of additional Honoleros will flood in with that. But how's it looking with the hot sauce? It's at negative two. Hmm. But we have a content population. Uh, 20% increase. That should be fine. Yep, we still have a positive one. And this should do something. It's still a negative two. Very strange. I mean, they're all working. All right. Anyway, we need to turn in the next delivery. There he is. It is blocked right now because of this message. <laughs> you have there you go. You have Enough to cover the um, bribe him once more. We can do this. Send some of your people to away to work for the actuary. Your final quota uh, is reduced. What? I think we're losing workforce with that. Or we bribe him, receive a large quantity of luxury goods. Um, we could afford the money. We could probably not afford the workforce. My final quota is reduced. This is <laughs> tricky. The thing is, I have no idea how many 
right? It doesn't say that at all, which is a shame, really. So I could just go into sheer luck there. Nah, let's just pay. And we get some chewing gums, rum, and coffee for the queen. And we do need to supply now 150 tons of silver coins in 45 minutes I can teach for the you final quota. All right, summer is over, so these can work again. Good news, Vasco. The next quota will be your last. Let's make it a challenge. Let's just make this one work now. We're actually down on timber. I don't believe that. So bricks is now so fine. Let's get us some sawmills working up again. We do need the timber for this very last delivery. And also saltpeter is out. So I think the next saltpeter work we can use because we got the workforce. All right there you go. Nah. That we cannot afford anymore. I mean we could. All right, and there is sure also there is the chewing gum. So we see that this is increasing my Obrero workforce there a bit, so we could afford a couple more productions, I think, 150 tons. We are not going to reach gold door, unfortunately, because for gold, you need to fulfill all deliveries, plus have 300 tons, I think it was, in addition, right? So that we will never be able to do. But silver, we can absolutely go for, hopefully. And we need to fulfill this one. We got 35 tons there left over. Workforce shortage. <laughs> All right. That's a problem, of course. And yeah, we're boosting the caoutchouc there. And the we are really pressing out everything we have from them. I don't think that I'm going to need these basins there anymore, though. Right? So I think... There's not that much we could get out of that. Um, happiness is fine, really. And the ponchos we could do. We could do the ponchos. That would affect both of them. Oh, and by the way, these ones here? Ah, they have a chapel. That's fine. Yeah, it's the ponchos, really, that we could still go for. Getting a bit more happiness out should be fine. And for the ponchos, I do need the... The linseed farm. This one. And we just have to have a couple of them here. I'm going with one here. Let's just see that we make this one full. 144. That we can afford. Yeah, basically uses almost everything here. Then we have the next one here. This one, by the way, is not getting full. So we just had a full monsoon season. Basically the maximum we can have there. There's another one. Of and that's probably it for this one. That would be... Yeah, only those two, really. Not a lot. Built them. And here we have the cow truck still working. And... I still have this ba base in there, though. But, yeah, I, I can't do anything with that anymore. So I think we will just be happy with what we have. I can activate the linen mill again and I can activate the Puncho Darner. Um, and also we can rebuild now lots of these Honolers here that kind of like destroyed themselves in the riots. Participate in the settlement of favors. Season of reaping. In the season of reaping, it is customary to settle one's debts and repay favors. Oh, I'm not going to use coin. Grant a favor to an old admiral. Okay, the movement speed of my ship is increased by 66%. Collect the favor you owed from the season of sowing. Yes, we had a, a favor open, right? Do we get something? Can I see that? <laughs> I don't think so. What did we get? I hope we got something. Oh my goodness! We got 100 tons of silver coins. Alright, so the final delivery will definitely be manageable. And now I'm looking a bit at the 300 tons that we could have in addition. I do need more of these here. Oxidation pools, they are working, right? So the silver ore is still climbing. We could get still another one of these out there. If I had the beach, there we have the beach area. All right, this could actually be working. So Peter, we have plenty of, not really. Yeah, let's get us, I need to boost them. Still fine. And then we get another oxidation pool here. 
right? Because we got everything else then. The cyanide leecher. Then we get the pools here. A revolt left your city in ruins. That's eight of eight. Get the where is a bit closer there. Perfect. Let's build this one. Cannot build more than that because we lack the timber. By the way, we lack the timber. Can I get it from somewhere else? We would be full on timber here. And the ship has just left. Let's use the ship for uh, getting a bit more timber over. We need that in the Cerro de Prata. Right. And any kind of ruins? Uh, there's still... Oh, the sickness has spread now to the inner city then here. Um, For that, I have no bonus anymore. I can move. No, we don't need to move. I can move this one here. And we should be able, yep, to use some more Honolulu's in there. Mm. I need to get rid of these guys here. So I can move those. Of course we can't. Of course we can't move them. I am furious. It's too close to the incident. Mm, let's move this one. Then we can get rid of this road there. And instead have the, the hospital here. <laughs> no. in one of your yes. Now it comes the explosion. I'm going to have it here for now. I mean, it's an extremely inappropriate location. But it's uh, close enough there. We lost a silver mine. There's some fires now too. Uh, where's my firefighters? I will need to build another firefighter here though. If we had the timber. There's my ship. Alright. So fire station ready. Lots of fires there right now. And two hospitals should do the trick as well. How's it looking with my productions? Very good. So the production is continuing now. Um, let's... Oh. My bad. Continue building some leeches here. They're now getting the resources. That would be the cyanide and the dung. No, actually not the, the dung, the, the silver ore. We have plenty of these, so I can really make this one fully work here. Cyanide leecher. And we probably can afford another silver smelter because of that. And then another um, royal mint, ultimately. The 35, 35 minutes. Also build another fire station there. Alright, and that silver ore mine. We do need more timber again for this. Timber, timber, timber. Spank me harder, timber. We need you. Give me timber. There we have it. For the, the silver ore mine. Working again. Then I just need more timber to rebuild my houses. Okay, we do not have enough workers, I think, for all of them, but at least another Royal Mint will be possible. Right, with that, we are going down there a bit of the Obreros too. But what I could do, I guess, is reducing some of my other productions that we probably will not need that much anymore. And one of them would be my uh, brick production, right? So we have the clay pits there working. Let's pause them. And let's pause these brick factories. That brings the Honoleros back on track. And we should be able, yes, to upgrade some of them. Um, so probably let's get rid of this block here and add some Obreros instead. So this will give me some workforce there too. Another Royal Mint is just going to be fantastic for us, hopefully. And we still have uh, 26 more minutes. That's It's just not going to work out, sorry. The delivery will be able to do, so we'll be able to finish all deliveries, most likely. But not the bonus on top of that that we need for the gold. I'm so tired. So, Ammonium, going down here, signed right now, let's build the next one, that's the dung, we should have plenty of dung, um, since this gold farm is now working too, and then the saltpeter, that is a bit of a problem there, right, we're sitting at 3 tons, um, I, believed we would be I think it's equal, but equal of course is also not so great, um, let's upgrade a couple of Honoleros, Do we have any ruins? There we have ruins. Let's just 
just that. And we should have some ponchos. Yeah, some 15 tons of ponchos. I will just get a couple of ponchos over there at some point to increase happiness. But it's just a temporary boost, really. It's not going to be that great. And yeah, this is just really crazy there, by the way. We are not able to get this uh, the, the hot sauce up there at all, right? So I'm going to build two more. Mm, and for that, I will definitely now need, though, to boost my other spice farm. So this one. Um, and for that, once again, we do need to make some, some adjustment here. So this one will have reduced fields, I guess. Or wait a second. No, the hospital can go away. Yep, we already built the other hospital, right? So let's get rid of that. We get the materials back, some of them at least. And this one here gets also its tractor. That we can have right there. I don't need any additional fields though for it, right? I just want the boost from the tractor, which is 200%. And yeah, there we can squeeze in one more. Can we not? It was within the radius. Ah, how very unfair. All right, let's get rid of it again. Another Hacienda Obrero. Perfect. So workforce is okay. And yeah, we should really be seeing some change there with the hot sauce now. I mean, come on. <laughs> Spice is still going down. Of course, it, it, it needs to start working there properly first, right? Before we can do anything here. In this area, the silver mines are working. We are at 180 tons. It's still increasing only at 2 to 3 per minute right now. Um, so... If I ever make a second playthrough of this, uh, what we can take from this, um, we probably will have to get two favors um, to get the silver coins for the last delivery, right? So two favors that we can turn in for the 100 tons each, I guess they are. Um, that would be 200 tons and then it would be realistic, I guess. Other than that, it's not. Even though, of course, um, storage-wise, we would also need to work on that. So getting some depots out there is another thing entirely that we could do and yeah the hot sauce i think is now more stable yep because the workforce we can see that and this would actually allow us to get us some more silver smelter so let's have another silver smelter just want to see how much how far we can push this one right this one is working now and then that would be possible to have another royal mint season of reflection as Vasco's final days on the island approach, he reflects on what his experience here has taught him. No man is an island. La Corona is doomed to fall. There is joy in solitude. Um, no man is an island. Uh, let's make there's joy in solitude. I like this one. I can't say I miss life at the royal court. The soft sound of the wind. Are you getting old now? Let's build this Royal Mint there too. And we can still upgrade some Honolores there to get more Obreros. There you go. Bit of an event out population once more. Upgrade this one. Spice. Stand aside, boss. We should see some nice attention. spice income there. And let's reduce the goats. Right, make the people a bit happier. We can reduce goats, for example. And I think sugarcane would be possible too. Yes, it's going up really, really steeply there. So the sugarcane can also be reduced, getting a bit of happiness back. Yeah, that spice thingy though. It's going down. At least the hot sauce is stably now, uh, stable now. What do I know? Right, let's just let's just work with that. We do have um, this plantation here that is the the sugar cane. We can get rid of this one here, since we have enough sugar cane, and use this to have some additional fields on the the spice. Yeah, right. With that, we get a bit more productivity out. Perhaps that changes, that turns the tide. But I don't know. Trying to make the best of the situation. We are now at a surplus rate of 3. Perfect. So at 220 tons. Um, still far away from the 300 tons we would need in addition. Okay, he has arrived. 150 tons silver coin. We can do this. And perhaps there is a surprise for us still. 
think so. The disgraced exile. You have my Bring me the silver. You have successfully met the final quota within the deadline and earned the right to return home. How do you hand over your final delivery? Deliver the silver smugly, deliver the silver angrily, deliver the silver pleasantly. Um, let's just show him that he can't break us and deliver it pleasantly. Yeah, smugly is perhaps a bit too arrogant. Angrily, of course not, and pleasantly. All of the very finest quality, I assure you. You are a most dedicated man. Collected your luggage. Alright, we would have now 30 more minutes to finish the coin. But even with that, we are at 90 coin only, so that we would get another 90 coin in with uh, waiting 30 minutes. Um, which is not enough, right? So that would only get us to 180 to only half of what is possible. So I'm going to Collect I'm going to end I'm going to end it here. Collected your luggage. You are a resourceful man by Count Oliver. Your lands and titles are hereby restored. Ah, how very gracious. You know, none of us ever truly thought you'd get this operation up and running. Now that it's producing so much silver, well, it really should be entrusted to someone more responsible. Huh. You think you can handle the weather here? Or the people? Giving orders is among my greatest strengths. You made it plan. Ah, onward then. Bear us home and don't look back. And off we go. Into nothingness, I guess. Into the sunshine. And we have finished this scenario with that. And now we return home to my estate and enjoy a reassuringly temperate climate. And I was sorry to hear that your most faithful actuary at Mundu Bauer has been unable to produce even a single bar of silver for you. He has my warmest regards. And with that victory, we should get the silver one, please. Yep, we get the silver one. So bronze and silver we finished. So we get these two um, skins now that we can also use in the base game, by the way. So wherever we want to. Um, and so, yeah. Uh, gold would be possible if we finish the favors, I think, to get the 100 tons of silver coin in addition. But I think it was successful silver for my first try. I hope you enjoyed this one a lot. I definitely enjoyed Seasons of Silver. Nice addition to the game. I can't wait for more scenarios they have to offer there. Really cool stuff. Um, and with that, hope you enjoyed this one. Wish you all the best. Stay tuned.